And once the export is complete, we already have our ex Windows Explorer open up and showing us where the song is as a WAV file. If you saved it somewhere else, then it will open up that folder as well. So I'm just going to close down my project and I'm just going to double click and have a quick listen using Windows Media. Okay, so it works fine on my Windows Media Player, and that means um, I can burn that into a DVD and a CD, I guess, or DVD, and have a listen to it um, at home or in my car or give it to friends and so on. But we want to actually make it louder and add some limiter so we can get, you know, fight the loudness war. <laughs> so I'm going to do that in Audacity, and at the same time, convert it into MP3 as well. So I'm just going to run Audacity, the latest version. And just going to drag the file into it. Yeah, make a copy, safer, I guess. And now my song is loaded. So let's have a quick listen in Audacity as well. Yep, it all works. Of course, you can go ahead and do EQing and to correct it even further if you like. But in this example, I'm just going to put a limiter and increase the volume because, as you can see, there's quite a bit of dynamic range from the song. So I'm just going to go to Effects and I'm just going to find Limiter. And there we go. Of course, I've got to select it first, Control A, I select, and then I go to it again, Effect, Limiter. I'm going to select Soft Limit, because I just want to softly uh, compress it down. Limit to, I guess, about minus 0 0.8 dB. And just do a makeup gain, have a quick preview yeah we can certainly uh, push those levels up let's push it about 3 dB for left and right and I'm just monitoring my levels at the top Yep, we can certainly push it a little bit more. And I'm just going to push maybe 6, yeah, 6 dB. We can push it. It can handle it. I'm pretty sure Audacity um, Soft Limiter can handle it. Yep, that's uh, definitely sounding a bit louder. Not necessarily better, just louder. And I'm just going to click OK. Now, that looks loud as well to me. So let's have a listen. Uh, let's have a listen from somewhere else. Okay, so that's definitely louder. So we can save this as a WAV file as well and burn this into our CDs so we can listen to them loud in our cars and our homes. But to export into MP3, just going to click File, Export as MP3. And just going to go to the desktop again. Lonely Road, MP3. 
bitrate preset, I guess they should be fine. Normally constant at 320 is a good one. And save. Right, here is the thing. I have not actually downloaded the encoder software called LAME, L-A-M-E. So if you are confronted with this situation and you cannot, obviously cannot find it, there's a button called download. So I'm going to click the download and see where it will take me. Installation section. LAME download page. Lame installer package. Just going to follow that. Going to download to the desktop again. It's quite a small file. So as you can see, we are actually doing this all together. Well, I guess that is done. So I'm just going to minimize that. I'm just going to try again. OK, so it came back again. So let's give it a try again. Ah, there we go. So it already installed. Next time around, it recognized it. I'm just going to leave everything as is. You can um, name them as you like. And it's being exported into an MP3. And there we have it. It's right there. Lonely Road, it's only 6.5 megabytes. Now that's the MP3 and obviously also loud uh, made it louder. This is the original. Now that was the original from export from Studio One Prime and this is MP3. At the top really loud over it. Well, there we go. That is loud, but still clear. That's only because we allowed at least um, 0.8 dB lower than the 0 dB clipping. So gives a chance for the encoder to encode clearly with MP3. Well, I hope this was helpful. If it was, please make sure you give me the thumbs up. And if you have any questions, I will hang up below and I will answer any questions that you might have in regards to exporting your song from Studio One Prime, importing it into Audacity, making it louder and converting it to MP3. Till next time, as always, thanks for watching and have a great time making music. Cheerio, guys.